Uh, just to confirm to the country that uh, as we salute our leader, the Right Honorable Raila Molo Dinga, the man we all rallied behind as we went into the last general election, a man who received actually the greatest support across this country over eight regions out of six regions out of our eight regions supported him. The majority of the county supported him. Majority of constituencies support. We believe he won that election. But with what was decided, we accepted to move on. We salute him and we thank him for his leadership. Kwa ile azimio la umoja wa Kenya, he has done very, very well. Now we are releasing him. Aende kwa kazi ya azimio la umoja wa Afrika. Amekua baba wa Kenya. Na tunamini anatosha kuwa baba wa Afrika. Ataendelea kuwa baba. But in Azimio, there will be no vacuum. We are several parties, constant parties of Azimio. And we've been very blessed to have very serious leadership in our coalition. Right Honorable Raila Molo Dinga was the second prime minister of the Republic of Kenya. And we believe he should have been the fifth president of the Republic of Kenya if Jebukati didn't do what he did. As he leaves, the next ranking member of the leadership of our coalition is the, is the Honorable Stephen Kalonzo Msioka, who was the 10th Vice President of the Republic of Kenya. So as we stand before the nation, he's really, it's a case of the first amongst equals. And we have by consensus, and I believe many of us uh, who are in this coalition have all consented to him taking over the leadership of our coalition. We have great faith in his leadership, his experience as the second highest ranking leader in our coalition, a very experienced diplomat, a great lawyer who has a clean record, a man of God, a man of integrity. We have no doubt that even as Baba leads to Addis, there will be no lack of leadership in our great coalition. In fact, we'll just get stronger. From tomorrow, we start the journey. We will be having our first town hall meeting at Ufungamano. We will be engaging uh, the Gen Zs and the youth of Kenya, private sector. Uh, we will be engaging civil society on matters of defending this constitution, wide-ranging matters from education, the model that uh, Babu Owino, who was a great student leader, has talked about. We will be engaging to look at all these matters, devolution, and we'll be looking at how we will then be charting the way forward as a coalition to take this country to the next level as a government in waiting. Thank you very much.